Look up to the skies It's a bunch of crazy guys They'll catch you in the street While you're eating next to meat Don't you look them in the eyes It's recover the supplies In a world of thought and spies One. Hey everybody and welcome back to Recover the Supplies. I'm your Game Master, Brennan Franz, joined by our awesome cast. We've got Ryan, Jay, and Tim, all of Stabcast, Fifth Trooper, and Double Critical Krabbuck Channel. Uh, we just wanted to welcome you back. This is episode 9 of Recover the Supplies. If you've been watching since day 1, awesome, glad to have you. If you just joined us, also love that too. Definitely go back and check out those episodes. We've got those playlists on Fifth Trooper Network. Uh, if you like it, do that like, share, subscribe, that whole yada, yada, yada that every channel tells you to do every time. Mm -hmm. uh, it does actually matter. We do actually care and um, do actually tell us in the comments what you think, what you like, what you didn't like. Um, we actually plan to use that stuff to kind of direct where we're going with this particular production. Um, also, just plug in that Fifth Trooper uh, website as well. Be sure to check out all the maps, packs, and content that's going live on there that you can purchase as well play on some of the same content and tokens that we have. Uh, also, shout out to uh, some of the individuals that created uh, some of the art for that. Uh, Jay, have we announced who those individuals are? Yeah, so uh, it's Lumberjack Nick and myself, and Ryan's writing the stories, so it's, it's pretty awesome. Um, we got a bunch of characters. We're going to start with about five, uh, and you'll get little character packs and stuff, and we have plans for more. We just want to see how those took off. So, yeah. So, I'm doing the maps. Lumberjack Nick's doing characters. Ryan's doing story. It's it's a, it's a group effort it's here. Yeah. Love it. Love it. So, cool. Be sure to check that out. Um, and without further ado, let's get into the episode. So, oh, um, baby. Zombie oh, time. Man, we are, we are in a mess here. So, did... Yes. Do you guys... Did we figure out what ship we're on? Like, yeah. did you guys see the nameplate? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're on. We, the, we, we did. <laughs> we're, we're on the Millennium Falcon. Let me zoom. Let me Falcon. zoom out for the folks. That is mm -hmm. the the old Millennium yeah. Falcon. Yeah, but it's looking a little grosser than normal. And uh, mm -hmm. you guys just killed some some. We well, we got into a fight. I got hit, and yeah. yeah, and and I talked to you. So for everybody else that's walking watching, um, I I talked to you, Brendan, offline about this. And mm -hmm. we agreed that while I have this infection that seems to be draining strain from me very right. rapidly, um, uh, you said that I could commit a force die uh, to kind of s to halt the spread of the infection. That's so that's in order right. to do that, because oh, I have yeah. a lot of medical training, I've, I spent a lot of my XP for even more medical stuff or uh, force mm -hmm. healing. Uh, so basically, I'll be committing a die to do that. So nice. that means I won't have the option to use the force while I'm holding back my own. Okay. Because everyone loves a selfish cleric. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Well, I have medicine checks that I can do. Can't do any healing when he's dead. <laughs> if, no, the thing is, I can still do healing because I had did dual class into a healer, and I have trained in medicine. But if I try to heal now, I have to do it without the force. Bah, right. bah, yeah. bah. I got to do it on my own. Yeah. Yep. So, like a pro DM, I took out the healer first. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what you do. <laughs> It's absolutely what you do. None and of I us think we also a backpack. So we talked about the name Millennium Falcon because we saw like the placard. I think when we were boarding it, right? Mm -hmm. But I think Ryan, I think Nisk was the only character that that it meant something to. Like yeah. I hadn't, I hadn't actually heard of the Millennium. Ne Falcon. Yeah, neither right. has Garrow. Garrow is so backwater that yeah, yeah. he hasn't yeah. Even heard of that. So we don't even get whispers of whispers where I'm from. Right? Like, have <laughs> you at home ever even heard of Fantuin? I bet you haven't. I bet right? you haven't. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, I've heard of a club called Whispers, though. So I think, um, <laughs> <laughs> I think Garo is. Uh, this is why we have you here. Sufficiently freaked out at what happened, and he's yeah. probably he's got yeah. his fibro axe, and he is like, like head on a swivel, and uh, he's like, "Have you guys ever seen anything like that before?" 
did you guys make any sort of roles to identify like like medical checks uh, or outer rim or anything? No, i know that i don't know what they are i don't all. think so yeah i've slept since then so i don't remember uh yeah. let's, let me see i could roll knowledge what do you want what kind of knowledge you want guy uh what kind do you think you want to roll i have uh zeniology and outer rim and lore so i'd say one honestly, thing any of those could apply and and We'll kind of, based on what you roll, we'll kind of determine what kind of information you get. Go ahead, Tim. Also, I want to say we also probably need to roll Destiny for this uh, set yes. as well. Yep. Okay. yep, let's go ahead and do that. Um, so you guys oh, are and pros by now, and I don't even need to tell you where to go. Let me go ahead and clear that pool before you roll. I yeah, mean, you say that, but we, Tim, does Tim know where the button is? Oh, watch. Watch and see. Ready? Ready? Ooh. Watch this one. Two, three. Yeah. Oh! oh, nice. Double, double light side. Yeah. That's Nicely almost done. as and good so, as a double critical. For those of you at home, we had been struggling with our dice rolling system. <laughs> we found out that if there's uh, music playing in the system, that the dice roller doesn't yeah. work. So we cut that shit right out. And so <laughs> now it's kind of, hopefully it'll roll. <laughs> no, no cool audio ambient music anymore. Right, I gotta right. make sure go through At least not through roll 20. I'll have yeah. to do it in yeah. post. Yeah. So I could grab my guitar and I could just play some like really. <laughs> that would be great. Yeah, yeah, we'll do that while we're playing. I'm sure there'll be no Speaking problems with of, that whatsoever. For those of you who have been watching, that sweet ass intro that we've been doing lately has been yep, yep, was yep, done yep. by Crabs. So. Oh yeah, hundred percent Crabs. Yeah, I don't know which way Crabs is for Jay, but he's one of those directions. He's uh, yeah. that way for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's uh, that's wild. So, Cheers, man. That's awesome. Yeah. Cheers to that. That was that was uh, totally unprompted, unplanned, and <laughs> totally appreciated. Just like everything um, else we do here. That's yeah, pretty true. much. So, pretty do we much. need to do anything with obligation? This one too, also. Yes, we're gonna go ahead and do that. So go ahead oh, and um, you go you know ahead. What? Why don't you guys roll a D one hundred slash R one D one hundred? All right. Somebody all call right. it those so all three of you knuckleheads don't do it. I got it. Oh, oh, 21. no. That's oh, that's bad. Somebody. That's real, real bad. <laughs> that's going to hit somebody. So let's see what we have here for the group sheet. So 21. Looks like it's going to hit Garo. Me again? So, Didn't we change my... Yep. Uh, yes, you're down Mine's to... Mine's to 20. Yeah, but it's all of us stacked on top of each other. Right. So oh, put order. Order. Um, And so I have you at 25, though. Yeah, yeah. That's um, me, then. So that's still gonna hit you. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, all right. So and you're listed first on my sheet. So. May I make a suggestion then? Yes. I would Always. say that seeing, even though he's not him and Zoltan kind of butt heads a little bit right now, he's probably a little upset at seeing another, uh, f you know, member of his party or his family, uh, you know get hurt and so i'll take a couple strain to as like him trying yeah. to focus on the rest of this mission yep and so this i mean obviously this is weighing heavily on you guys you don't know what's going on um this is not a comfortable environment you are i mean the smells are disgusting um yep. the sights are disgusting so um is so that Garo okay is at negative two to, yeah no right. i love it Right. Uh, your your strain threshold is at negative two, and everybody else is at negative one uh, to your threshold, which yep. means that it's just that much easier for you to pass out. Yep, understand. Right. Um, and I think I'm at actually nine right now because we never, um, you know, I, we haven't rested since last session, and so that no. after the combat and everything. So yeah, we're rolling right that's, into it. That's so. that's not that's not great. No, no but my th my threshold is normally thirteen, but now it'd be twelve. So I've, I got a little yeah, bit. I, okay, a little bit. You'll be all right. <laughs> maybe okay so maybe i'll roll that knowledge check yeah go ahead. You, well uh, okay I so i have the same three. so outer rim and zeniology are the same for me so what one uh gm extraordinaire hey. would be a better <laughs> would get me better information oh, there they are there they are jay <laughs> 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 gotta, love, gotta love that diesel engine outside, outside my house. The 45 that. minutes of pre-show. Yeah. I love how Brendan's no <laughs> wearing PJs. He's wearing PJs. It's five o'clock in the afternoon where he lives. And it's like 106 degrees out. Oh I'm gonna God. point out 
I've got a dog that barks ridiculously anytime any sound in the house happens. Yeah. But yeah. not once during all of our sessions has she barked. Ever. ever. We've never. Yeah. Only yeah, you wouldn't ever. even know. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. She's, well, she's a very good girl. Our, our dogs are important members. Isn't that the my one that bit you in the face a while yeah. back? Yeah, it is the one that actually bit <laughs> my face. Like, <laughs> she's, she's not quite She's the best dog ever. Yeah. <laughs> For my face apart. <laughs> She's the only dog who has tasted my blood. Oh, perfect. Yeah. All right, do you you want me to roll this? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, pick the one you want to roll, though. So so whichever one, and you'll get information accordingly. Or not. Um, or yeah, not. not. Yeah. yeah. Uh, my dice were so, pretty good. All those setback got me, though. Yeah, despite everything that you know, I mean, you, you hung around the the cantinas you've studied you've been out in the woods in the wilderness yeah there's nothing like this you've ever seen before all right fair enough son of a biscuit yep. all right so yeah while, while garros and and uh, zoltan are kind of looking around the room looking for more zombies i've definitely still got that like thousand yard stare slowly meandering my way to the uh to the cockpit of this legendary ship sure and, and I'm just I'm just on my knees, kind of like trying to catch my breath for all of this while I'm committing that force time. And I will go with Nisk on this piece of shit ship. <laughs> That's Garrow's opinion, but yep. <laughs> I mean it is mostly green. <laughs> yeah, so. yeah. Just to your left there, uh, Nisk. I don't know if you can see it so well. Um, that is a door right there that is closed. Okay. Okay. Cool. Just so you know, it's a little yeah. it's a little hard to see, but I just wanted you to be sure that is a closed I door. I'm going to imagine that, you know, Nisk has been around. He's probably not been on the Falcon before, but it's, I mean, YT 1300s and, and YTs in general are pretty stock standard. I imagine he could find his way to the bridge without having to, to yeah. crawl around. While we're, uh, while we're doing that, Brandon, can I roll perception? Yeah, of course. All right. Um, what are you looking for? Just like to not be ambushed, or he's looking for love in all the wrong places. <laughs> Ain't that the or truth? in Alderaan places? Yeah. Hey. Oh, 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 Alderaan. Uh, and so I don't know anything out of the ordinary. I think. Okay. Um, I will set the diff there and go ahead. Okay. Isn't um, everything out of the ordinary on the ship right now, though? I suppose. Barely, yeah. So I guess. Um. <laughs> That all right? That may not is that was that too vague? No, you're fine. Go ahead. Uh, I've set the difficulty according to your vagueness. Is there anything I can do to boost? <laughs> mm, not really. I mean, unless you as a party were all collectively searching, you could assist each other. No. Okay. Yeah. No. I'm I'm heading I'm heading for this bridge. I got to figure out what's going on. Why? Oh. This year. Okay. okay. Advantage. Yeah, that's fine. Um, but, that's fa but that is a failed perception check. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Shut Garrow. up, Tim. I mean, I know. I mean, I'm serious. <laughs> Pretty sure, Garrow. Um, don't, don't ships like this usually have like smuggling compartments so that uh, so that like if they get boarded and they have contraband on them, they can they can kind of get away with stuff. So I'll I'll say kind of say that out loud to Nisk as I'll be like, hey, you know, back home, ships like this generally have like hidden compartments and stuff, right? For for contraband if uh if this is indeed general solo's ship i'm uh i'm almost certain there's something hidden aboard here or at least at least spaces for it but that uh that can wait kid we gotta we gotta see what this thing is doing out here right sounds good buddy so i'm staying behind yeah. where they are and i'm gonna check out um the corpses and see if i can oh uh, good let's split the see party well, my character is like still on the scene, right? Like I'm still, yeah. I was hit with like a, a a really serious illness, so I'm like I'm still on the ground, probably unable to stand quite just yet. So, so uh, okay, yeah. So Garrow is going to suggest to Nisk that he pop that he take a step back. Garrow pop the door, and if anything's on the other side, he can shoot it. Okay, so you're gonna sure. ready in action then. Um, yeah, like, so I'll, I'm going to hit the door, you know, hit the door, ready the action and, and then have Nisk kind of, I think mechanically speaking, we're going to allow you to use cool on an initiative because okay. technically something could get the jump on you, but you're setting an right. ambush right now. Yep. So that, yeah. that is very much using the cool skill. Perfect. 
Um, so uh, yeah, if you want to go ahead, uh, you guys are opening the door. Nis, do you want to take a step back, or do you want to be? Oh. Uh, short, short friend. I mean, yeah, know, okay. It's getting a thousand yards there. Aim that gun of yours in there, buddy. All right. Uh, so he pops the door. Oh. There are two of those creatures, and they are ready to hop on you guys uh, once they turn around and see you. They're like, "Oh, lunch." I like don't actually say that, of course, but they start gurgling. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to ready an attack action. Sounds good. Yeah. All right. uh, go ahead and roll some cool for the initiative pool. I'm um, assuming you probably hear that, right? Let me remove all the turns that we have in there. Um, yeah, you do, Zoltan. Zoltan, by the way, what have you been doing? We have not heard from you in like a couple of minutes. No, I was just kneeling, kind of trying to catch my breath and just checking okay. out the uh, the corpses to see if I gather anything from that because I may try to. It's know, pronounced yeah. core, by the way. The, core. the P and the S are silent. Like. I want to. I want to gather my three core minimum and uh, <laughs> and it's a couple of special forces. All right, yeah. So I'm gonna roll. Uh, let me roll initiative too. You want me to roll cool? You said. Yes. Go ahead. You want cooler vigilance from me? Uh, was Nisk like prepping for attack, or was he just no, kind of rolling no. with it? Yeah, he's just rolling with it. Okay. Nice. Hot damn. Uh, yeah, those are some good rolls. All Woo. the paint. Love all that, all, the paint. all that additional there. So let me go ahead and get that sorted for you guys. Boom. Um, so yeah, we have uh, one PC and then the NPCs get to go. So who's going to act first, guys? Um, not to metagame too much, but it definitely should be me before oh, great. Jay makes my shot harder. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Well, that was um, the whole point, right? Well, you yeah. did also have your gun readied. Yeah. yeah, I yeah. Well, I'll spend my maneuver here to to pull my my weapon out and then just haphazardly kind of fire my my round right. down this corridor. I'm gonna call this a short range shot. Pretty much everything on here, unless you're engaged, is gonna be short range. Sounds good. Um, have you got everything set on your end? Uh, you didn't have your weapon already pulled. No, I'm I'm like Nisk is thousand yard stare. Okay. Just get to the get to the door. Okay. Like, no, okay. So Garrow thought he did because Garrow was like, "Yo, yeah. get your gun out." Yeah, hey, I'm gonna pop the door, and, and he's, he's like, like uh -huh. "Yeah, uh -huh. yeah, sure." And Daryl's yeah. like, "Are you ready?" And he's like, "Yeah," <laughs> and he just was not ready at all. Pretty much yep. like any time you deal with Jay, and you're like telling him something, he's like, "Yeah, okay, <laughs> yep." Uh -huh. yeah. Brendan cool. will call me. Yeah, and I'm like, "Uh huh, yeah, uh -huh, yeah. that's yeah, that's interesting." It. Rachel, Rachel really doesn't like that either, guys. <laughs> <laughs> so if it makes you feel better, I do it to everyone. <laughs> It's uh -huh. part of being married, I yeah. think. Yeah. yeah. You oh, can totally. hear them, but don't process it. Right. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Money shot. Money. Money. Um, Not a, quite a critical, though. Not yeah, quite. Yeah, good. Um, soak is two. Um, and it looks like you've got 10 damage there. Yes. Yes, sir. Okay. You nail one, and your blaster fire scores into the other one, um, tearing into it, and it looks. Um, I mean, it's already pretty much dead, but it's looking more deader. More dead. Um, yep. Yeah, I'm definitely here, gonna folks. use some of this advantage to to clear some strain from that all that starship pilot and stiff. Seems good. Okay. Uh, this one is going to go ahead and move over since they are short. It's going to move to engaged and it's going to attack Garrow. Not Garrow. Yo, what? Yep. Well, it's this closest. Yeah, that's true. Um, oh, I hope you don't get infected with this awesome <laughs> infection, Jay. Yep. Uh, and then we've got a brawl attack. Do you want to upgrade? Do you want to spend a destiny point to upgrade the uh, difficulty of its uh, attack there, Jay? So, uh, oh, I did not roll enough uh, there. Let me change the difficulty. Apologies. Uh, which way are you changing it? I'm gonna make it more difficult. Okay. So, Melee's then yeah, no, I won't. I won't spend it. <laughs> there hey, we go. he failed wow. really bad. Uh, Holy cow! That was a much much worse roll than what I rolled previously. I'd like to say that he failed so bad that he tripped and just fell on my axe and made it look like Garrow stabbed him in the head. Well, he actually rolled oh, he advantage does, though, so he oh. does roll with advantage. I rolled oh, a yeah. lot of advantage. Yeah. All right. Um, Fine. Yep, and in this case, I'm going to force the target to drop the weapon that it's wielding. What? 
So he doesn't hit you, but in a swinging clawed uh, rake of his arm, he knocks uh, the fibro axe out of your hands. All right, fine. Uh, <laughs> you can use your maneuver to pick that fibro axe right back yeah. up. Yeah. Yep, absolutely. You'll just basically lose an option to aim. Uh, not if I spend a strain. Oh, then you could aim as well. Yeah, somebody's mofo. learning how to meta game. <laughs> yep. Um, I wonder. Okay, let me think about this. I don't know that he would pick up his axe. I think he might just grab his force pike and just use that. Because I got another melee weapon. Well, yeah. Because well, I'm, I'm trying to think. Would I like if a zombie's on top of me, knocks my weapon mm-hmm. out of my hand? I'm not going to bend down to pick up my weapon. I'm going to go like this and like hit him with my other weapon right? right so that could be my maneuver is to pull out the the force pike okay sure uh then i will spend a strain to aim yep two strain uh two strain yep that's right and then so I add a i've blue. got diff two in the in the dice roller for you okay i'm gonna shout don't let him touch you like in <laughs> okay <screen>. buddy and <laughs> okay and then uh he's gonna strike are you ready sir Oh, and that's a critical. Yeah, it is. Well, that's going to kill him. So right? he's going to take oh, the he's, force pike he's and he's going to shove it right through his eye hole. Yep. Ah. yep. Nice. It uh, obviously it gurgles and then slumps down and becomes fully motionless at this point. I'd like to say at this point, uh, can I spend the advantage to... Can I? Oh, no, that was for the critical, right? I can't. Uh, uh, you spent two for the critical. You have one left. Can I, can I clear strain? Yeah. Okay. So I have that ability that I can clear two when I clear one. So. Ooh, neat. Oh, that's nice. I'm going to do that. That is, what was that called again? It's called Jay made it up and he's got it on a sheet. Cause oh, I did it make up. it up. Uh, no, so it's when, I guess when healing strain. Is that is yeah, that right. what I just did? Yeah. Yeah, you're healing. Oh, strain. okay. So it's rapid recovery. So, uh, for those of you playing at home, that's Edge of the Empire, page 72. Uh, heal one additional strain per rank of rapid recovery. So, I'll take two off there. And then I want to, he's going to do that thing like the samurai does, where he takes his pike and he just wipes it on the side of his pant and then puts it back <laughs> and grabs his vibro axe off the ground. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, just a little, good uh, just good a little... job with the Thor, Thor kid. <laughs> And then, like, you, you get a nod, and then obviously the blaster goes right, right back into the holster. <laughs> yeah. It's not like any up commando ready position is mm. to the distinction of, of Garo and Nisk. Garo, Garo's like, I'm pretty sure there's going to be more of these guys. You want to be ready, buddy? Oh, and since I was last in order, I'm going to run uh, up with my with my sword <laughs> ready to go right as Jay kills me. Like, I'm here. I'm here, guys. You just see it. Point it's me like, right at him. Sh- Point me right at him. I'll get him. All right. So, good, uh, good on the reinforcements, Zoltan, as always. And uh, yeah, just keep keep walking forward. Kid, take the lead. You got the axe, slicey thing. Okay. So he will start heading up. And are these the? Uh, I'm gonna check out and check out the corpse. Is this the same type of creature that attacked us at the beginning? I'm gonna... Yeah, it's. Um, I mean, it looks like it was semi-humanoid at one point, um, but. You know, biologically, something terrible has happened to this. You know, it, it, it probably was a human or, or near human at one point. Um, but now, you know, chunks of skin are missing. Uh, you know, nails are all worn. Fingers are all stubby. Things are bad. Um, and know. it's, yeah, it's just disgusting. Wow. All right. Um, so while they're doing that, I'm going to open this door right here. <laughs> Dude, what? <laughs> I love it. Uh, so hold on. In the door. I'm right next to the door. So no, 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 no. We did not open that door no. yet. No, no, no. Okay. We have not no. discussed we this. We have not opened that yeah. door. We are walking, walking down to the, the door. Yeah. yeah. So while we're doing that, I, I want to be very clear. Oh, God. You mean we don't count to three and open both doors at the same time? <laughs> yeah. Um, so rather than have you guys uh, re-roll initiative, um, I'm just going to yeah. go ahead and um, I'll roll 
uh, my initiative. Well, and then, then... why do you get to roll yours? I want to re-roll mine. Fine, we'll all re-roll mine? initiative. All right. Why mine was awesome. No, I... right. no we're re-rolling initiative. <laughs> Too late. You're off the border. We're Everybody doing live. initiative. Dagum it. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Mine's busted. Hold on. Let me re-roll. Oh, you it. got a bonus. Th wow. Oh, you you roll one that. and three. There you go. You rolled it again. Same thing. <laughs> that's, Literally the that's, same. Woo! That's awesome. <laughs> got him, guys. I got him. All right. Mm -hmm. So one way or the other, you were going to get a one three. Uh, so it looks like we're in the same order. One piece of <laughs> Literally, <laughs> Literally right. did nothing. What a gigantic waste of time. You're welcome, yep. everyone. You're welcome. Yep. All right. Um, so here's my question. Uh, as far mm -hmm. as distance goes, if I just like pull a Han Solo and run like a coward away from mm -hmm. these guys, because I've already sure. been bit by these things. So I don't yeah. like, I think my character is like freaking freaking out right now because he doesn't know what's happening to his body. But he opened right. the door. Speaking of which, did you commit that force die? Did I commit? I did. Yeah. That's what okay. I don't have the force die right now. Good, good. I just wanted to be sure because otherwise you were going to get about like four or five strains. Sure. Yeah. So that was the whole purpose of us like talking about it at the beginning is that okay. I was just going to have access yeah. to the force. We talked about it, but I'm just like, did you actually do it? Well, that's really all we do is talk about stuff, right? Yeah. yeah. Right. Yes, that is right. true. So, yeah. Um, although running away probably wouldn't be that much of a. I don't know. Do, do one of you guys want to go first? Or uh, I think you'd have to probably move twice. Oh. The real you, question is, you what would the door. Robin do? All right, I'll, I'll move up and attack. I'll move up and attack. I, I, I'm tempted to run away, but I'm... <laughs> what? I'm going to go first. <laughs> so you're going to hit him with a melee? I'm going to move up and I'm, I'm going to melee, yeah. Okay, go ahead. All right, oh, let me find my... Uh, fudge. I didn't expect to be doing combat quite so soon. So Really? Uh, you didn't think they'd be behind that door? No, no. I don't. All right, here we go. Hey, hey, nice. That's hey. so, I me mean, seven damage. Good job. Ambitious. Damn. Uh, yeah, that's um, that's seven damage. Uh, that takes down one of them in front of you as you cut him down. All right, so the closest oh, one. Bonk. Yep. All right. So at least I forced the next one to have to move if he's going to go after yeah. me. Yeah. Well, I imagine. Yeah, arguably, I'm kind of doing this. Group. Yeah. So he's going to gather a minion group. Yeah. Just kind of shambling over each other. Yeah. Um, okay. So that was yours. They are going to aim and swing at you. I will spend a destiny point to upgrade the difficulty of this um, okay. back roll. Do Jeez. it. Good job. So, yeah, because my character is like, oh, no, no. I'm going to pull from whatever cool. I've got. Yeah, go ahead and hit that uh, button. I'm looking for it. Uh, should be top of the sheet. For, yeah, uh, should be. To use destiny. Oh. Right underneath your blue and up do I dice. need to click on it for you, Grandpa? Yeah, go for, go for it, man. Because I don't want to I don't want to slow things down. <laughs> Thanks. Right on. <laughs> did you just call me Grandpa? Yeah, yeah, yeah. he did. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, that happened. <laughs> okay. Uh, Kravik sat on the remote again. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, crab arc. Oh, God. I, Tim, I want you to call Ryan like once a week with like, hey, do you know why my internet's not working? <laughs> oh, boy. So it looks like I'm getting hit again. Yeah, you're going to take some damage on that one. Mm -hmm. uh, um, it's only 05, though, so that's good. I don't know oh, why I'm that's gonna, different than 5. Here. Brendan, roll a setback die into there. What? Why four? At a, at, uh, because Tim's cutlass has defensive one. It does have defensive one. But he didn't tell me about it, so how do I know about because it? Because you've been involved in every other se session that we've had so far. If you look at his stat block that's two text bubbles above it, it says Ooh. it right there. Ooh. How do you know stuff that I don't even know, Ryan? Because <laughs> he's the better player. All right. <laughs> you got no advantage on this one, at least. Yep, yeah, no advantage. Right. Uh, so that's seven damage. What's your soak? My soak is four. Four? I'm gonna say three. Holy cow, that's a crazy. Soap. That's that's a very high soap. Dude, that's, well, yeah. that's that's mine too. Money. Okay. Yep. So you glad I hide in the back. Yeah. What was that? Three damage. Mm hmm. All right. I'm gonna have to throw some more guys at you. Let me let me tuck some more on the map. Here. No, I'm already like I'm already crazy, right? Like you already want yeah. Brian's like, don't do it. <laughs> I'm squishy. All right. All uh, next PC in the order. I have a question. Uh, you hear? Yeah, yes. yeah. That's what I was going to ask you. Go ahead, Brendan. Um, you hear some sort of shuffling and scuffling and something coming from another room nearby. How, like, 
You guys should run around opening doors. And I'm just going to call it, out, be like, Zoltan, are you coming? Like, I, we don't yeah, know. Yeah, is it really going apparent on. what's going on, or do we just hear like Zoltan exploring the ship? I like, mean, is it apparent? No, no. I'm going to shout out my Jedi Master's name when I'm attacking these guys, so you guys are going to know. What's like, his what? name? <laughs> what's your name? <laughs> what, what, what? Yo, you're asking. Chuck. Are you, Chuck. Uh, <laughs> Joshua! Yeah. No, it's, it's actually, it actually is Chuck. Yeah, I'm going to <laughs> I'm gonna be like mother chucker. <laughs> oh, first name Norm, right. last name Chuck. <laughs> so we we I hear him know. yell Chuck. Yeah. yeah, you hear you hear Zoltan yelling Chuck from the other room. What I don't know. I've probably been around Zoltan long enough so, to, to know right. what that means. So Gary, I'll look at um, Nesca go. Uh, There's okay. just a, a deep exhale, <laughs> and then the, the rifle comes clicked out of the holster again, and with no real apparent speed, just Nis kind of like wants to get to the bridge, but just goes stomping back the other direction. <laughs> uh, and you can tell me if I can with with a maneuver get where I need to be, uh, Brendan. Or one maneuver will get you to right where you're at. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll suffer the two strain and uh, and move to to get a shot. Okay. So it should be what per? Uh, well, I guess just a single red die to hit this yep. guy, right? It's with me, It'll right? Be one red. Yeah. Um, and oh nope, I got to put that in the right box. So we got two yep, sheets open, line. and they look awfully similar. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Okay. Go ahead. <laughs> he shoots oh, one of he just well, shoots Zoltan. Um, I'm so glad he just drops right. that motherfucker right there. Yeah, well, I think that actually is hitting Zoltan. Uh, uh, but no, but he doesn't hit. He actually misses. If you if you'll notice, but not a success. Um, there is actually a there, there's actually a specific I, sidebar for shooting into. Um, I do think I have to hit. Yeah, um, I, I thought I read this, that. This, this could mean I run out of ammo. This could mean more bad guys. When show. attacking this could mean target, any number of things. An ally, the attacker upgrades the difficulty of the check by one. In addition, if the attacker's check succeeds, but you generate at least one. Okay, so yes, he did fail. All right. Yeah. Not hitting Zoltan. I'm so disappointed right now. I I kind um, of am too. To be real. Yeah, but frankly, it was going to be very cathartic. Oh my goodness! <laughs> uh, the character looks at you and mouths the words like, "What the are you?" So, <laughs> um, so Nisk and and Ryan, you know, one of yeah. our one of our seasoned veteran players here. Um, tell me what this looks like in regards to your advantage. Sure. Yeah. 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 So I start. Uh, like, I'm just kind of fed up. These zombies are making me, like, I'm not mad at them. I'm more frustrated. Like, mm -hmm. I just want to get to the bridge. I just want to see what's going on. And, like, the the falcon being here is the weird thing, not the undead creatures. And so as I start just kind of bleary-eyed, spraying uh, the the room in blaster in blaster fire, um, maybe, uh, I have an idea. maybe for all this advantage... I, we create a bunch of ruckus and a bunch of a bunch of noise that if there's any more of these things on the mm -hmm. on the ship, they'll they'll hear and see all their comrades being cut down, and they're more likely to be afraid or trepidatious of us. Okay, okay. Um... What if you shot a hole in like one of those hidden compartments, and maybe we we saw? What is it with you and holes in ships? <laughs> right. Not, not really. a hole, but yeah. right. <laughs> I mean, you're uh, talking about hidden compartments before. Maybe if you missed, maybe you. Yeah. You don't. You don't have spare ammo on you, do you, Ryan? I'm a Boy Scout. I'm pretty sure I do. Okay. Because <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and hit you with uh, character's ranged weapon. Immediately runs out of ammo and may not be used for the remainder of the encounter. Oh, the encounter? That's lame. I, I brought an extra reload. It's fine. Uh, yeah, it'll, it'll take my my maneuver to reload it. So. Nah, you know what I like better? I like that in the course of your spring, you actually hit the control panel and it shuts the door, locking Zoltan in there. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm all right with that too. I like it. That's that's the spare Next word. time, don't tell him. Like, I don't mind your choice. And he's like, oh, in that case, let me pick something even worse. 
well, hey, that means I can spend 25 credits and negate one of the worst despairs you can come across. Yeah. <laughs> so the so door is shut reasons. and it locks yeah, the door in. Now shut and he is now locked in. Right. So now it's my turn, right? Oh, no. my character's going to be mad at you, dude. Like, we may have some conflict after this. I hope so. So I'm going to. All right, I'm going to come here for my first movement. And then I'll come up here for my second one and just see Nisk next to the closed door and be like. And a burnt out. Sizzling. Yeah, burnt out. Oh, <laughs> no. And I'm like, oh, is Sultan in there? I missed. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like Gerald would laugh at that point. He would just like. Just, just yeah. the shoulders go up. I yeah. missed. He's like, I'm, I'm sure you did. <laughs> <laughs> he's, just, he's like wink. <laughs> so how does PvP work in this game? <laughs> right? A little bit of that. You can't. You don't hear what's going on the other side of the door. Uh, uh, and I do believe it's uh, it's your turn, if I'm not mistaken. It's it's top it's, I guess that's the top of the round. Garrow pretty much needed to use two maneuvers to get there. So. I'm going to yeah. take this. And no, I'm just kidding. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, do what you got to do, Sam. Wow. All right. Um, hmm. All right. So I think I'm just going to attack. Uh, sure. So. I mean, that's uh, what I would sure do. I, got your difficulty, right? uh, I feel like I'm missing something, though, because I don't see the dice pool thing where you can add dice or or, or do anything. Very top of your uh, sheet. Yeah. There's little there's little drop downs. Um, okay. Yeah. Oh, you the gotta keep an eye out for the drop down right. arrows. I see it. I see it all the way. All right. So I'm going to use a light uh, uh, Yeah, I'm going to use a uh, destiny point. I'm going to upgrade this attack. Sure. Ooh. Yo, you started to upgrade it on your difficulty, so go ahead. Oh god. All right, and I'm going all the triumph, all the despair. All right. Hit it. Okay. I do have uh I guess I'll take a train for that or sure. yeah. Yeah, that's fine. actually pretty bad for me, but I can handle yeah. it. But that that makes sense too, because I just saw like while killing him, I'm like Wait, did they leave me in here? Did they cut me in here alone with these guys? So my character is really mad at Nisk right now because I didn't see Garo. I didn't. Mm -hmm. I only saw Nisk shoot the control panel and lock me in. So my character is furious. Yeah, Garo for sure was not there yet, but he's not. <laughs> he's definitely not doing anything about it now. But you wouldn't know that. So. All right. All right. So um. All right. So combat's over. Uh, well, we yeah. don't know, so I I would say uh, Garrow's gonna like knock on the door yeah. with the back of his fibro axe, and like so. I ask you, to hold. you still in there? Hold, hold this, Garrow, and I hand you my blaster rifle. And can I try to jimmy this door open with some skullduggery? Um, is that really skullduggery, or is that more like mechanics? Uh, I believe it is skullduggery. Okay. Um, for forcing open a locked door, uh, oh, yeah. mechanics sure. would be like repairing something. Yeah. I'm down with that. Um, let's see. Do we have a page for a good difficulty on that? I got my AOR book today, which page I know is the wrong one. 85. And, and he blasted it. It wasn't locked. This, I, I would imagine it would be a standard difficulty because it was an accidental lock. It wasn't a, a locking on purpose. Yeah, I'm just thinking, like, due to the situation, it could be also crummy just because, or maybe I could give some setbacks. Just yeah, first of all, like, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, setback makes sense there. So let's do that. Um, I'll put two setbacks on it because this was, you know, despair yeah. involved. And then I'm going to go with absolutely. difficulty three. So, well, Tim's locked in forever. All right. All right. Well, I'm going uh, nice to. Yep, there we go. Oh, hey. Ah, <laughs> nice. You force it open, but maybe you cut um, your hand or something. Catch character meeting. Yeah. And and there was zombie juice on the okay. door, and you got infected. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> um. Yeah. So when you do that, um, there's a electrical pulse that shoots through the ship. Oh. Um, the and the door over to the other compartment over here actually opens up. Can you ping it? Yeah. Uh. I'll put a token there so you know. Oh, oh boy. So we're going to stay in combat order? <clears throat> yeah. Uh, we'll go ahead and stay combat order. Um, okay. Our door's and... open now, though, right? Yeah. Yeah, this, this door. So first this you open. lock me in here, and then you summon more minions to attack me. Thank you, Nisk. You don't know. Yeah, you don't know he did that second part. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, force things. Evil oh, no. <laughs> you can't use your force right now. 
Oh. <laughs> I, I hey, see Jay, a great many tokens. Are you zoomed in or zoomed out on the map? I am zoom. I can see the one up there now. Go ahead and zoom out. Oh, balls. Oh, my God. <laughs> All the doors in the ship have unlocked. Oh, God. Do we know I'm that yet? That. Do we know that 100%? You probably have a... Uh, we would, we'd probably hear. If I'm gonna need that back. Yeah, you start hearing noise throughout the ship. As, <laughs> I just uh, like hand, like <laughs> slowly hand it to you. And like, oh, no, I I'm uh, this gets like our Garrow's uh, jeez, Garrow's like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. He doesn't know this one's up there yet, right? So he's like, guys, I want to know. But just just before before we go any further, I want to just say. It's been great knowing you guys. Yeah. Even mm-hmm. though there was a sudden betrayal at the end, um, as the final episode of Double Critical <laughs> Podcast, I just want to say, at least we found the Millennium Falcon. Right. That's right. Yeah. Uh, Garrow, we didn't recover it, but but we found it. So we uh, did not recover the supplies. After that's all. right. Well, okay. So hold on. Before I do anything, Brendan, I want to. Yeah. We heard the doors open. I don't yep. know that these guys are down here, really. Right. Like we do at Meta, but the character yeah, doesn't yeah. know. Uh, I, I would say the passive perception. Um, you hear. Yeah, we hear footsteps and you hear and movement stuff. throughout the ship, but because the echoing metal yep. can, right? You're not going to know necessarily where and how many, but you do hear a volume of movement. Oh God! All right, so Garrow's going to be like. He's going to come in here and he's going to be like, Zoltan, there's more coming. <laughs> Did you summon them? What? What? what, what? So I'm like, I'm, I'm already pissed. I'm sneering. I'm, I'm he's going to be like, yes, this is all my fault. I've summoned zombies. <laughs> I, I have magic powers. That's what happened. And he's like, I'm, Nisk, get in here. <laughs> I'm yeah. so mad at Nisk right now. I, I'm, I'm, I'm fuming. But I see this other guy over here to our, uh, our left that like, our, I'm like, we'll, we'll talk later. Yep. And with that, this guy's going to move in. And he's going to attack Nisk. Because he's the nearest one. <laughs> get, get him. <laughs> <laughs> get him, Ray. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're going we're gonna to burn that. God knows we need it. Yeah. Sure. En- enjoy the destiny points, Brendan. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they're going to get used. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Suddenly a Rancor appears out of one of the hidden... Yeah, I'll go ahead and give you one back. Um, cool, 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 cool. God, what were those things from uh, uh, oh, Force God, Awakens? The... The Raktars. Yeah. Uh, let's see. All right, got that, got that. Let's just make sure I got everything good. And boop. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my God. What's your soak, Ryan? Uh, two. Two oh, is awesome. <laughs> so, seven? Cool. Oof. But the two disappeared. And then what do you want to do with the, uh, what do you want to do with that, uh, setbacks there? <clears throat> well, uh, maybe, uh, I, this guy comes up as we're, as we're kind of taking some positions here. And I want to kind of, as he knocks into me, I kind of take half a step back and grab Garrow by, like, the, uh, the lapel and throw him into into the space that I once occupied. Sure. Let's Go ahead and move your token and I'll move Gara. Great. <laughs> Sounds You're good. Throw everybody else over today, aren't you, Ryan? Yes. <laughs> oh, you Ryan, by the way, you're 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 bitten by that machine or by that thing, aren't you? Uh, I didn't see an advantage roll to trigger any weapon qualities, sir. Um. Yep, no weapon <laughs> qualities were triggered. Um. Sir. <laughs> DMs this or DMs <laughs> to stretch and break all the rules. Oh, that's true. A that's green true. dragon could land on top of the Millennium Falcon right now, or maybe a space whale. Okay, oh, fuck. <laughs> we've got more of them incoming. <laughs> really high movement. Okay, though. so let me let me ask this question. That's all they're doing. Those moving. Yeah, 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 yeah. So Garrow would like to. Uh, I'd like to do three things, and I understand one of them will require the two strain. So can mm-hmm. I aim, attack, and then move? Yeah. Okay, great. And then I'll spend the strain for the move. Sure. Okay. okay. So I'm going to aim. Yep. Uh, let me... Depending on the attack, you might not want to move. 
Right. Um, so let's go ahead and go there and there. And I'm just making sure I got everything cleared and reset on the dice roller for you. Okay. Um, so I've got ready. base difficulty two and no other modifications. Um, let's see. I want to. Yeah, I'll go ahead and spend one of those dark side points so you guys can play with them as well. Um, Thanks, yeah. And then, so I've got an upgraded difficulty on this check for EJ ready when you are. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna look up. Yeah, what's uh? I was trying to remember. What's Sunder again? Uh, Sunder, Sunder is the ability to destroy armor. armor or weapons. Oh, all right. Well, so okay. you can you can trigger that effect, and then you basically don't deal any damage, but no. you cut their weapon apart. Now let's. Uh, okay. All right. Here we go. Ready? <laughs> May the Sunder force be neck. with me. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh! Nice. 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 Yep. That one's dead. He cuts that mofo in half! Boom! All right, and then uh, I'll take... Nice. I'm going to take two strain. Uh-huh. And I think... <laughs> Sorry, Tim. <laughs> and uh, I think he wants to move, like, <laughs> around the corner. Um, mm -hmm. But he's going to kind of, like... Oh, fuck. Does that make sense? Let me think about that. So that'll that'll open you guys up, won't it? Who is Garo as a character? That's up to you, man. Yeah. Uh, That's for us to find out right now. <laughs> shoot. Is there... What else could I do? Could I... He's somebody who needs a haircut. Yeah. That's for sure. Um, uh... Be a good little animation, Garo getting a haircut. Right you know now. what? He's, he'll spend it to move in front of Nisk. I think is what he would wow. what he would actually do. So let me add that strain. He definitely likes Nisk more than Zoltan, right? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> for, if we're being if we're being brutally honest. So then, because that was the bottom of the order, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I think I'd like to, because then I could take the top. Uh, yeah. Well, hang on. Yeah. yeah. We have Tim. There's one Tim's more piece. Oh, all right. Yeah. Because yep. yep. I right. opened the door. All um, right. So Gar gonna... Garo's like, let's let's funnel them in this door, and then they can't like, you know what I mean? Yeah, I'm gonna move up. I'm gonna upgrade, and uh, I'm going okay. to attack. Um, let me make sure I've got your difficulty set proper. Uh, go ahead, uh, set your own upgrade. Um, he doesn't did... even need it. No, I yeah. think uh, I think that was I think that's right. Is that with an upgrade? Let oh, me make sure because okay. I I hit the use the light side point. Oh no, I did I didn't. No, and I didn't okay. roll right. So I should just re-roll. I'm gonna re-roll the whole thing. No, that's fine. I can I mean if you want to keep the roll, I can just give you the dark side point back. That's fine, yeah. Yeah, just give Whatever. us the give it yeah, give us the point back first. So okay. right. So that'll be uh what eight? Eight damage? Uh yeah, that'll yep. take one of them down. Um for the dark side, instead of a strain, can we give one of them just a uh, like a blue die for the, or like a uh, an upgrade for their next? Uh, one of your a, a boost die for the yeah for their next attack. Um, that would require um. Uh, well, I guess the, the the setback is up to or the threat is how however Brendan wants to spend. Yeah, the threat is yeah. what I spend. So yeah, so um, it could be a strain to me. I mean, I've got I'll have one more left before I pass out if that if you give me a strain or uh. <laughs> Or you can give them a setback. You know, I'm actually okay with giving you one more strain because that prevents you from getting two actions. Because you're you're basically like locked oh, I wasn't taking I wasn't taking two actions ever again. Yeah. Anyway. Oh, I know, I know, but yeah. but that's just like it really like as a as a game mechanic, right? It's gonna really lock. No, you. I you yeah because you can't do it. I can and meet then, my. And then on top of that, if you get another strain, like through another like well, bad roll, when you meet your out. strain threshold, you're not out. It's when you exceed. No, it's you're exceed. Out. Yep, it's when you exceed. Okay, so I do have one more to float, but I, yeah, I'm not. So yeah, I'll, I'll I'm push. Not, I mean, I'm not playing around. Oops. <laughs> I'll push you closer to tipping. It's uh, fine. And then so so, what was your total damage? Your total damage was eight. Eight. Yep. Yeah. Um, let me check these guys' soap. So I kind of like. Cut one and then cut into the other one a little bit, maybe. Okay. I yep. Yep. Uh, yeah. I just wanted to make make sure I knew where their damage. So it's were. like a sideways slash into the uh, into the doorway. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
I have a I have a bad idea at the top of the uh, top of the round if, if we want to go with it. Sure. Right, Full yeah. of bad ideas. You know what? This is a bad situation. This is a yep. bad ship. I don't like this so, ship. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I spent quite a bit of advantage earlier to, to make these guys kind of trepidatious and scared of the of us. Mm -hmm. Can I just start throwing, you know, moving into a position where where I can see out the door and just start firing less in an attempt to hit them and more of an attempt to frighten them out of this room? Um, yeah, I'll, I'll allow the attempt and we'll see where it goes. Cool. What do you want me to roll? Intimidate. All right. Coercion <laughs> it is. I'm, I am very bad at coercion, but uh, do I get anything for all that advantage I spent earlier? Uh, yeah. Give yourself a uh, three boost. Sweet. Wow. Lord he's he's going to make this like a, a, a five die difficulty. I mean, they're pretty much dead. So yeah. You're trying to intimidate the dead. Yep, but I ain't scared. I'm a little scared. I'm a little this scared. Is, this is not going to work. Oh, it God. Work. All right. Oh, my God. Well, that would have been blank. a whole lot worse. That target has a building resentment towards you, though. though. That's right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, congratulations. You taunted them. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Cool, 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 cool. Oh, good. That's actually, that's actually not, not terrible. Nisk is now at the top of the threat meter. <laughs> and it's their turn. Um, uh, boom and boom. Oh no, it's our wait. Yeah, that, that NPCs, yeah. Because it's one PC then two NPCs, and I took the yep. first slot, hoping to frighten them. Um, so yeah, so these first two who are the ones that really saw, they're actually gonna end up wasting a maneuver, right? They could have aimed, um, mm -hmm. and and just gone after Zoltan, maybe even Garo there. Um, but they're actually gonna move up and swing after Nisk. Um, make sure we, I got everything good here. here. I got a question though. We've got this many. Are they going to function still as just one group with just one single attack? Uh, yes. Yeah, so the way that it works is a minion basically doesn't have skill points. Um, so they 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 literally don't have the ability to upgrade any of their checks. But what happens is is the more minions that are in a group, they get an upgrade for each body after the first. Um, so these ones being two, they basically are treated as having one rank in that skill. Um, and so like, basically what I did was I absorbed this group together. So now they went from being a pack of three to being a pack of four. Um, and, and so that's kind of the way that I'm working it there. So yeah, um, there's a group of two of them that are engaged with me, a group of four of them and a group of three of them. Right. That's the way I'm, I'm reading it. Yeah. Oh, there's three yeah. groups. All right. Cause I only see yeah. one. So they're all going at the same time. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 And I'm just sense. for, for simplicity, right? Like otherwise okay. we'd be interrupting the hell out of this. Sure. So gotcha. I'm just going to, I'm just going to roll them as three different groups here. Mm -hmm. um, okay. And then depending on how you cut them down, that actually weakens their own attacks because they're less coordinated and they're le there's less bodies going on. Right. Um, so anyway, uh, so they're going after Nisk. I've got a difficulty of two. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use a dark side point to give myself another upgrade. Go for it. Um, and let's go for Never. Nisk. Oh, now. So just yeah. one shy of a crit there. Um, but I am going to go ahead and activate. You are poisoned. Neat. Um, so yeah, so that is seven damage before your um, your thingy. Oof. All right. Wait, it was just so, shy of a crit. Why did he roll crit? Nisk because I exceeded, I exceeded my wound threshold. Oh, oh. So yeah, okay. And you're winded now. I'm. Um, and that does that yes. incapacitate you? Yes. Okay. All right. So let's we need to see. kill those guys that are on Nisk. I can potentially use a, uh, a medicine There's check a to try There's a poison, and I'll do these. That seems good. So unconscious and uh, oh, and I can flip you upside down. Ooh. There we go. So Nisk drops as these things start clawing and biting into him. Um, these guys move up. And they are going to go after Zoltan there. Um, is there two bodies there? Yeah, yeah there's one. yeah, you're in the, in the way. Is that a okay. group of three? That is a group of three. Okay. Um, just adjust now, the one body was in the way, so I think they should get a setback on their attack. Sure. <laughs> I mean, realistically, narratively, there's yep, a body yep, yep, in yep. the way. Sure. Uh, so this attack is going after Zoltan. Your laughter puts me closer to death, so be careful. Good. Put, good, your, good. put your laughter in check, Ryan. Nope. I'm the one unconscious on the floor. I'm going to drink bourbon and watch y'all die. 
Uh, that reminds me, I'm going to go ahead hey. and remove one PC from the uh, from the equation. Um, since NISC used the top one this order, I'm going to remove that one. Okay. okay. All um, right, so they miss. You've got... Uh... Yep, they miss, and you get to spend one advantage, Zoltan. How do you want to spend that? No, that, that's an advantage for you, that's right? That's an advantage for you, yeah. Oh, my bad, my bad. Yeah, as um, much as I would love to, I, I, I think that's for you. Yeah, uh, I'm going to get a boost die on the next attack because you are off-center, and okay. they are pressing the attack. Sure. But that's on that particular unit. So, um, right. are you no, now... it's the next ally. Oh, the next, the next ally. ally. Yeah. Yep. That makes sense. Which is the group of four. Which, yeah, right. of course, because they need the boost die because they're they do. even stronger. Uh, yeah. I'm going to spend a force die to let's, let's spend a force die. I would to, like um... to make an argument here, Brendan, of your sure, what do you got? GMing of these zombies. Yeah, what do you got? Why would they single file line up? Hmm? When they have they filled that, when they have filled that it's hole. Cha cha slide, man. Cha cha slide. Okay. It's I'm using right. a, I'm, just I'm using a dark side. Uh, I'm using a light side point to upgrade the difficulty of their attack. Um, Dude, uh, we're all we're dead. Can... No, we're not dead. We're gonna. We're... Is Jay's that what you're saying, Jay? Jay. <laughs> yeah. In... Jay, is that what you're saying there? Yeah. I'm like, we've got this. I'm gonna shout. I'm like, focus. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say focus, and I'm gonna put it. Well, put a little accent on it, embracing my. I'm just Heritage. saying, Brendan, I don't feel like zombies would just line up in a row. Like, I feel like they are You're all fine. there. You're like, rah, 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 rah. Here's the catch, though. Yeah. That's a group of seven now. Uh, whatever. It's a lot of dice. It's a lot of dice. Wait, wait, wait. But for this attack, since the group of three already attacked, they, they don't get move. another attack. <laughs> Can I push in Zoltan into the zombie group and then shut the door behind him? <laughs> yeah. So, so... <laughs> no, no, no. Well, because that door is broken. Great. Jay makes yeah, a great point here. So, so what I'm going to do is, is that group is now a group of seven. Yeah. But, um, they're the the extra four that just added in are not going to get an attack. Okay. Because they're gotcha. they're part of that swarm. But next activation, they're going to hit like a truck. All right. So I I hit a uh, use light side point, which sure. I, I didn't need to. So can you give me that back? Because I yeah. thought I was defending. All right. That's fine. All right. At the top of the order, um, what I'm going to do is. Yeah, it's, it's all right. I'm, it's Jay, right? And then it's the top of the order, or no? Is it, oh, Jay didn't go yet. Neither Jay, of it's us. Both of you. Neither of us went. It's both of us. It's both. You can do whatever you want to do. Ignore me. I'm dead in all the right. corner. Since I don't have to shoot into, uh, like, because I'm meleeing, I'm not shooting into range. I think it makes more sense if I go. Right at the top of each round, you'll suffer one string. Cool. All right. Uh, I'm gonna upgrade and uh, I'm gonna aim and shoot. Okay. Shoot. All right. I've got that. I mean, swing, swing the uh, okay. swing, swing for the fences. Uh huh. I'm yeah. gonna go ahead and upgrade and make it a little harder. Snarkamaguga. All right. Snarkamaguga. Oh no. Snarkamaguga. <laughs> yeah, Sir, this is a children's show. Oh god, this guy. <laughs> we just got our R rating, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna shout for Chuck. All right. Um, oh, hey, that's not too bad. All right. Now I know one of those guys had some damage on him already, so I'm yep. hoping this is enough to take out two more and. We've got a PC next, so I'm going to give Jay a, a boost die, a blue, with the advantage, uh, if that's okay. Because that's seven more damage. I think that's enough to take out two, if my math is correct. It is not correct. Well, it does take go. out one. Okay. Boom. Okay. All right. Um, so, Jay, but, but yeah, I'm going to spend the advantage to give uh, the next PC slot a boost die. So Jay, Jay, you're getting a boost die. Okay. So I know you can be the hero you have always yeah. wanted to be. So this is your chance. Darrow's gonna go to Zoltan. He's like, I'm gonna go save Nisk. <laughs> and then he's gonna run up now. <laughs> um uh he is going to <laughs> he's gonna step there. Uh mm -hmm. because then I can help both at the same time. I couldn't figure out, you know, it was I think that's good, right? Uh, so I'll sure. do that. Um, so that was move, right? Or does that count if it was just one? Does any movement count in, in yeah. this? Okay, okay. Yeah, at this point, I would say. Fudge. All right, he'll he'll spend the strain to, to get an aim. And he'll attack the guys that are on NISC, so we're not getting flanked here. Well, I guess, okay, so here's my argument against that, right? You have a force pick, right? No, vibro axe. Okay, you switch to the axe, then yeah, I would I would say you need to move. Okay. Yep. All right. And then uh, 
We got the blue die already. Remember to add the blue die in. So I have two blue die then. All right. Yep. Nice, 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 nice. Here we go. And, and then, oh, do you oh, want to spend on, a light side on, point? Before you roll. Before you roll. Um, I, I, th- think I think we I... should save those for defense, homie. Yeah. All right. So yeah, I did not. Um, I did not add a dark side point to this roll, so I have reset it to just standard two. Let's see. Let's see a double critical. Okay. Do it. Do it. You ready? Mm-hmm. Oh! oh, you do get a critical. Oh my That's god! Gonna kill three. It looks. I think. Uh, that yes, happen. but that group is only two. That's fine. That still brings us down to a single attack. Yep. Yeah. And more importantly, you're not flanked now. Yep. Yeah. So um, I'm going to go ahead and chuck so, this body over here because it's going to get in the way. Yeah. Did that advantage go to the criticals or can I spend it? Well, let me, you, let me look at the map. You got Pierce 2 yeah. and 11 damage. You did not need to spend the advantage. So I'd like to esp- spend... Uh, how much do I need to spend to remove strain? Uh, just one for one. I'll take okay. I'll do one, and then I will give the advantage to our to the next uh, to Zoltan when he goes. Okay. Yep. You now you're thinking about portals. It's yeah. like that meme of like the kid in the 1980s commercial who looks at the like who's sitting at the computer. The internet is good. Yeah. 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 yeah so I mean, um, not to meta too much here, but I was thinking we should reserve the light points for defense because if we go down then it's real bad i think our, i think our offense is good enough with an aim that we'll be okay like i think we should it's it's not been bad but the yeah. uh the the chance for the uh the triumph is and a whole extra critical which is really really special if if you can manage it so uh, well, that's that's why i can't been spend triumphs if you're dead <laughs> True, I'm already uh, infected, though. Yeah. So, uh, I don't need her. You don't even care. You're about to turn on me anyways. All right, go ahead. I already feel uh, the third. Yep. Right, so they... Um, that swarm is piling on to... Um, piling on to uh, Zoltan there, and they are just thrashing at him. Okay. Well, three of them are anyways. Yeah, I'll Let's I'll just... use a light side point for defense here. Sure. Yeah, it does make sense. Yep. Uh, here we go. Oh, that's not bad. That no, could have I... been a whole lot worse. Look yeah, at that. Could have been a lot worse. Yeah. That yeah. could have been a whole lot worse. Um, so that is seven damage. Okay, and my silk is four, so I'm gonna take three more. Mm-hmm. What are you What are you at now, and what's your threshold? Mm-hmm. Um, I'm at six wounds, fifteen threshold. So I'm I'm okay. <laughs> what a tank! He, they chipped one of my horns a little bit, right? They chipped one. Oh. I'm like you. I'm, now I'm mad. Now I'm very mad. All right. So we're going to the top of the order. Mm-hmm. I have a boost die already from Jay's previous attack. Yep. So um. I've... And uh, sorry, I got to do a thing with my advantage. You do um, your thing. Remember, this is a PG-13 program. No, no, no. We're R. Yeah, it's going to get a boost die on its next attack. Did I, I, I've already said the F word twice in this recording alone, so. I, 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 I haven't heard anything like that. I don't even know what you're talking about, Jay. <laughs> all right. I just so, tune Jay out most of the time. So, so. I'm going to. All right, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to so use people. another. We have two light side points remaining, so I'm going to use one of them for attack. I'm going to aim, and I'm going to swing. I'm, I'm going all out for it. You ready? Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, hang on, hang on. Oh. Oh no, but that was a great no no no, that wasn't that great. No, I had all kinds of crap left over in that pool. That okay, okay, no we go. gotta re-roll so I'm it. Sorry. No, that was a miss. That was a miss with triple critical. So I, I guess that was a good thing that we we're not doing that one again. How do you even I love how we just had a conversation about saving that for no defense. We, more. we also and have, then... <laughs> we, have, we also have light side for defense if we need it. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. We have one. We have one left. All right. Well, we, well, we you have, have your two. you have your uh, you have your extra one. I'm I gonna got... spend one defensively because okay. I want my guys see, to live. See now I have... care about them. Yeah, of course you do. Um, All right. So you've got your stuff. I've got my stuff. Make it yeah. happen. I can't spend a you know strain again no. to to try and get a double aim, but that's okay because I got two blue die, 
Here we go. And before I do this, I am going to actually uh, say Chuck, Chuck, Chuck. I'm going to say it three times like Beetlejuice. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, all, right. all right all of a sudden biggie smalls appears yeah. <laughs> yeah all right well i mean that's at least that's a success and as opposed to the other one yeah that's mm -hmm. that's eight damage absolutely yeah mm -hmm. yeah this ought to be enough to take down two considering last turn but okay um it takes one down and you wound another one okay all right. Um, Jay, I think you're next. Yep. Orc rules apply. I remove from the back, fourth edition. So, okay, let me ask a question. Where I am, Brendan, mm -hmm. if I was to do really well, would I be able to get two of them or do I have to slide oh, yeah. over? Okay, okay. Yeah. They are, they are one group. Yeah. So I'm going to aim twice. I'm going to take mm -hmm. two strain for the second aim. Yeah. Okay. And then I'm gonna spend the light side point. You can do it. We no, got no, 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 no. We need him for defense. I'm going. We've got two. No, we need him for defense. What? And so I'm going to. <laughs> you have three actually. Uh, oh. So you're using one right now. Mm-hmm. Well, now I have to. You're right. Chris. Well, you already rolled, didn't you? Oh, no, you didn't roll I didn't roll yet. Yeah, oh yeah. Then you better. All right. I All right. Here there. we go. Ready? Mm-hmm. Come on. Come on. Good All thing right. you did. Very good thing you did. Yep. That's going to be double critical. Double critical. <laughs> bum, bum, bum. So, so anytime we uh, we talk about the objective recover the supplies on the stab cast, I just get a nice low key plug in <laughs> yeah, that yeah. everyone tries to shoot over. <laughs> yeah, and listen to your no, last podcast. I have, I have and no. They all gave way. you a hard time. You tell yeah, those guys. You tell those guys that Crabox says they suck. I, you except know what? For everyone, for Tim Hannon, for everyone for listening Hannon. and everyone in here, don't let them give you crap. They all yeah. secretly message me and ask me uh -huh. questions all the time. So you know what? They want to be a part of this as much as oh, everyone they're jealous. else. Oh they're yeah, hundred percent jealous. A hundred percent. Guess what? It the looks... rest of you guys, you're never <laughs> Stabcast. You're never gonna be part of anything Fifth Trooper unless you leave my boy Ryan alone. Except for Tim Hannon, because he is, <laughs> he's the golden child. No, especially yeah. that redheaded <laughs> fuck. I'd actually like to adopt him as as my as my fourth son. Well, that you know what they need to do? They need to team up and just make the Tim cast. You keep that like, bearded yeah, ginger I'm, demon I'm, away from me. <laughs> Too bad we're not putting this on Twitch, and I could clip this. Yeah. We'll, put, we'll call. We'll, We'll call it the Cinderella. The Cinderella. I'm sure Jay can still get you that file. Right? I'll get you the audio. Yeah, I'm, Don't worry. I'm gonna need it. I'm all gonna right. need it. Um, okay, so I took out three. Three, all three in a row. Boom. Um, do I have any advantage left? Nope. No. Okay. I assume you wanted to use it to maximum effect. Yep. So. Yeah. All right. Good. I'm good. Jay with the superhero poke, right? He slices I know, right? that thing. He slices it and it goes right through to the guy behind him, and boom, like the boom, bones boom. splatter out of them, impaling a guy that like that was almost out of out of the. the frame. Jay, you tell me what that. You tell me what he that was in the like, back. It was, your, it was your attack. So I would imagine, because of Garrow's setback for this mm -hmm. for this this uh, play, right? He's like, in his mind, he's like, no one else will die. Like he's kind of taken on this protective role because of what, you know, we learned in an earlier episode, what happened to his family. And even though him and Zoltan kind of like butt heads every once in a while, he sees Zoltan now as part of his, like his troop, you know? And so he's like, no one else dies. And he just like, maybe like slices through one and he pushes it back into the one behind it and then like thrusts it into the final one. And just like right through their skulls, their little beady eyed, mushy skulls, and he just goes. Choo, 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 choo. Anyways. Zoltan's really impressed by this, by the way. So like Zoltan looks at you like like a brother, like for the for the first time since we've been together, like there's like a a real respect that like has finally like blossomed. Yeah, he absolutely yelled that no one else dies, and just was like, ah. So all right, that's awesome. Yeah. I gurgle on the floor and suffer more strength. That's, um, <laughs> He's <laughs> you're foaming at the wow, mouth. Well, this guy. No one else died. 
Listen, you can only do so much, all right? <laughs> I can't kill these guys and heal Nisk in the same move. I should probably try and heal Nisk, yeah. All right, so I got a minion group of two. Um, they are going to aim and swing at Zoltan. Use, your, use the light side. Use the light side. Use it. Use it. Well, we got three remaining, so we good. Because I'm going to try and heal yeah. Zoltan. I'm going to heal, try and heal Nisk with a force. Thing. I'm saying I'm use and... one. Well, he's he's attacking. Oh, you want him to give to use another one? I want you to use it for defense. I'm rolling. Oh, no, I can take it. I'm not even going to spend it right now. <laughs> There's just two of them. We'll be all right. Or we'll die. Who knows? See, he missed. Yeah, He missed. What's the success you're going to give them? Maybe right he's going to disarm. Yeah. I hope he disarms you by ripping your arm off. Knock him prone. Probably not going to happen on a mess. <laughs> I know. He's looking at that book. I think he's eating something. I think he's trying to like, he's chewing behind the book. Yeah, that's he's exactly like, what he's doing. Nom, 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 it's like, nom, give, nom, me, nom. I, give me my I pizza, woman. <laughs> have and if any of you guys are wanting to run one of these games, I will say all three of the Star Wars GM screens are the best GM screens I've ever seen. They're really good. Yeah. They're I've got the Force and used... Destiny and the uh, and yeah. the uh, Edge of the Empire one. So those are the two like, I have. I don't have the Age one, but it's really yeah. good. Yeah, like, like they um, actually put relevant, useful information on the back and stuff. Like your like, critical uh, sheet. Yeah, you know, are you? I critical? will say the Vampire Fifth Edition one is pretty well designed too, because it was designed in like 2018 or whatever. So. Mm. Oh, and like, for those yeah. of you listening, uh, I mean, it was announced a little while ago. If you haven't heard, they moved. All of the RPGs, the Star Wars RPGs, to another division within Asmodee, and they rehired the guy that was running yep. it for FFG. So, yeah, Sam news. Stewart just announced yep, that. Sam That's Stewart. awesome. Yeah, That's so good. good news. This is going to continue. So, I just I thought that was a good little segue. More importantly, I... go fucking support them and buy shit because yep. that's yep. the only way that division stays yep. afloat. Yep. Like, By the way, a little just keeping it simple. Yeah. Sam Stewart is his likeness is on the cover of Twilight Imperium Fourth Edition. So if you're yes, looking for that uh, that human on the front, that is Sam Stewart. No, oh, that's no cool. kidding. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's pretty dope. When you've been that's with uh, Fantasy Flight for five years, yeah, you five get your years. likeness uh, imposed on a piece of artwork that makes it into a game. Oh, that's yep. cool. Yeah, yeah. Wade Wade Peach even got his for uh, what was it Arkham Horror? Yeah, I I'd like to point out that you guys didn't even have to be with Fifth Trooper for more than five days, and I did your likeness on That's artwork. True. So. I know. That's true. <laughs> By the way, I freaking love it. I just want to like shameless plug that. <laughs> like, like I adore the opening cartoon that we have. I fell in love with it the first time we posted it. So. Well, now with Tim's music, it's even better. It's, it's even, even better. better. Yeah, objectively, I I think there's a, we're gonna get three dislikes for that. So I'm gonna go ahead <laughs> and get uh, melee. And it'll be, and it'll be Ben, uh, my Tim, and Will. Yeah. I'm gonna get a melee defense on my guys because they didn't do anything else useful. Okay, he's fixing to be my adopted son, so he better show some respect. <laughs> <laughs> um, Which one of you is older? I don't know. I'm pretty old. I got a baby face. I, I think it's. I, I think it's, it's Cocoa Bar. I think it's this Tim. Yeah, it's this Tim. <laughs> um, okay, so Garrow's gonna say to Zoltan. Uh, Go heal Nisk. I'll take care of these guys. Uh, you've. I'm just gonna nod in agreement. Okay. All right. Um. So I'm gonna I'm gonna move over next to Nisk, and he's down. Uh. He's got this. It's it's basically like a critical injury. So what I'd like to do, um, mm -hmm. because I've I've leveled up. I've kind of maxed out my my force uh force healing ability. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna pull it up right now because uh, it's is a pretty cool ability. I'd like to try. Okay. Um, all right, and uh, so let me check with you and see if I can do this. Um, so I've got control critical. It's the it's an it's an end line ability for force healing, and mm -hmm. I can make a heal power check combined with a hard medicine check. And okay. if the check succeeds, uh, one target who heals wounds also heals a critical injury. So I'd like to try and use this to kind of heal the uh, the virus within him. Okay. It would also heal wounds uh theoretically so okay. how much you're yeah. also going to take a strain because you're going to have to uncommit your force die yeah i i, I recognize that so I, i'm gonna and so this is and actually this like this is a hard thing for me because i'm mm -hmm. i'm allowing the virus to to kind of ravage me and i've got one point of strain left so if i succeed 
theoretically I can immediately then recommit my my force die, but I'm risking my own life to try to save Nisk right here. Okay. All right. So um, this would be a hard medicine check. Mm-hmm. Um, and that's three, right? That is three. Okay. I'm you, gonna add a force you, die to the die pool. Use a light. Yep. Yeah. I'm use gonna a, use a light side yep. to to upgrade this. Yep. Uh, I've got the upgrade in there, and then um, we have extra light sides on case I roll dark side points. Uh, yep. I can spend those as well. All right. Um, I think we're ready. Wait, no, I'm, I almost rolled my weapon. I got to find a medicine. <laughs> Stab. <laughs> 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 this is for the door, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Just kidding. All that setup. I have the ability to critically heal this guy of an unknown disease. I can do all these things, but fuck him for that door. I'm going to kill his ass right here while he's thrown. He's like, oh my god, it would be so good. He's like saying this out loud to Garo. He's like, oh, with my force power, I can heal him. And he's like, wait a second. He closed that door on me. And it just... <laughs> Dark side engaged. No. Uh, what is it that the dude, the bad dude in Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom says right before he, yeah, yeah. he puts your heart? Kalima. 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 Chuck, Chucky Ma? I'm going to think of it for a second, but then I brush those thoughts aside, and here we go. Oh, my God. Oh! Success? Whoa. Wow. Success, threat, triumph. With a triumph. Oh, my God. Okay. And you take two strain. <laughs> I knew that was coming. All right, so here, so here's here's my thoughts. Um, that that the two strain is gonna is gonna knock me unconscious. Oh, mm -hmm. sure. But what if the triumph is to clear a number of strain that I'm not unconscious? Like, like, is there a certain number that a triumph would do? No, but I will let you heal him. Get rid of the uh, the uh, strain and um, actually restore all of his wounds. Okay, so here, so here's what's gonna happen. Um, I I use the light side point since I haven't assigned that yet to be mm -hmm. one advantage. So I'm only gonna take. I guess that would be only be one strain. Okay. Okay. Um, which 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 knocks me out. Um, but it doesn't put me anything past that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Oh, and I'll have the. Wow, oh, I was gonna say, could the triumph also uh, be something that um, allows me to like halt the spread? Or no, no, I don't know. I, no, I, you can get rid of the disease. Period. For both of us? Uh, no, just for him. Yeah, just for him. Yeah, yeah. So I'm, I'm, yep. I'm curing his disease. Uh, I'm maxed out on strain, at least for the rest of this session. Mm -hmm. and so I heal him. He's up and back to normal, and I and I and I collapse. Yeah, and I, his critical injury that he uh, suffered is gone too. Yeah, and I'd like to point out that Tim's wife has told him he's too loud. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna let that slide. That was yeah, we 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 we've got a bunch of kids. We're doing a sleepover tonight, and so uh -huh. the good thing is I didn't wake anybody up. Hey, I I appreciate it, and the audience while you're watching this, you should appreciate it too. Tim is so <laughs> invested. Know. In this video and in the fifth trooper being successful, we'll cover the supplies that he yells while children are asleep. And now the spoiler of where why I work. Yeah. Because it's a slumber Because it's a you're slumber a, party. You're at Tim's slumber <laughs> party. Does Jaden get invited? Nobody sleeps until I heal Nisk. <laughs> All right. All right. So I'm I, I'm down. Right, let me, let me mm -hmm. delete that okay. crit. So I'm no longer poisoned. I'm no longer winded. And you've um, healed and all the way up, right? Yep. Is it? Oh shit! It's all the way. Nice. All right. You get all your health. Mm -hmm. All right. As Go. you are filled with a with a feeling of like you haven't felt this yeah. fresh and awake and vitalized in months. So you see. So I guess too, when you wake up, right? You see Zoltan drop. And then, and then Garrow's basically yeah. heading up to like go get these other zombies. Yeah. So yeah, you hear just the sharp like I imagine at the same time there's a sharp intake of breath and then a clunk clunk. Yeah. As uh, Zoltan hits the deck, um, as we we do the the I guess the force heal is actually transferring life in in this cannon now. Nice. Look at us staying canonical. That's yep. kind of like exactly what just happened, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're like Baby Yoda. Uh, yep okay so i am gonna move up brendan i moved uh so that'll mm -hmm. be part of it oh well unless can i i can't hit them both from there right from where yeah, i was i don't care well, they're, yeah they're, they're they're one oh. minion groups so. all right uh yeah. aim aim sure 
take the strain, gain the two. I am going to use a light side point with the offense right now because we just sure. got, we got to end this. Um, and so I'll add an upgrade. Mm -hmm. Okay. So Ames gave me two blue. I got the upgrade and I'm going to swing. Ready? Yep. Go ahead. Oh, 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 oh. Woo yeah. Yep. So I just imagine like Nisk, you you like take this. Mm -hmm. You wake up, Zoltan drops, mm -hmm. and then you see Garrow just chop these two guys in half, and you just see dead zombies everywhere, and Garrow's the only one standing there <laughs> with like zombie juice all over his blade and everything. Or everywhere. Yeah. So so probably how this works is we get like uh, the shot over Nisk as Nisk like sits up into it. Uh, we see kind of behind him Zoltan fall, and then the reflection of his scanner goggles, we just see like a slash of a vibro axe and then blood covered Nisk's face. <laughs> as, as it's just all from that real tight angle. Yeah. And, and you get a brand new John Williams fanfare. It's like a whole new thing, like Duel of the it's, Fates, but it's, it's the Gero theme, yeah. yeah. Yo. Can I uh can I clear some uh, strain? Uh, yeah, with that, actually, you had enough to kill both with one swing. Okay. Nice, 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 nice. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. It's that pierce. That pierce is just gross. Yeah. Um, yeah. And so, like, I, I imagine, like, uh, Garrow's just going to kind of take a breath. Like, I know he didn't really notice what Zoltan did because he's busy fighting. And so he, he's just going to take a breath for a second because he just, that was intense there for. Yeah. <laughs> A bunch of a bunch of color comes back into this face, and he just kind of sits up, looks over at Zoltan. What hit him? And then Carol's gonna be like, "I think you." <laughs> um, I'll pull out of my pocket because you know Nisk is no no medic. I'll pull out of my pocket and hit uh, hit Zoltan with a, a stim pack. Although I'm pretty sure it won't do much of anything. <clears throat> Well, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know how that would work if I'm unconscious. I guess it would heal some it's, wounds. It but. would still give you five wounds back, yeah. But so uh, I can I'll come over. I have I have a rank in medicine. So Garo, you hit him with a stem and then I'll roll medicine yeah. check. Okay. Brendan, yeah, you're gonna have to decide what happens here because I'm down to only one wound. Yeah. Uh, but I'm maxed on I'm at thirteen of a potential twelve on strain. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, there is a medicine check that can remove strain. You know who can actually remove strain with a medicine check? I, I can. <laughs> Go ahead. Um, let's get to medicine. So medicine is on one one two in uh, in Edge of the Empire. Um, and so yeah, uh, advantage uh, generated yeah. can uh, remove strain. Okay. Um, Although it's up to you if that strain actually comes off it. It may have a cap. I'm guessing, like if it may have, a, like you can only remove up up to this much. Yeah, I'm thinking we can we can probably uh, either cap it or have it, um, but enough to wake you up is probably you know right. anything greater than zero is probably going to be fine. Uh, did Did you have a medicine pack on you, Tim? I have. I yeah. I've got all the stim packs. I've got. Um, I haven't used any yet. Do you have but no, no like do an you, actual healer's kit? Do you have a healer's kit kind of or anything? Oh, uh, I, I actually have tools. I, I believe I do. If he uh, does, if he does, uh, could I grab it and use that to upgrade my medicine check? Interesting that the um, the difficulty is actually based on the number of wounds he's suffering. Mm -hmm. mm. Um, so so it's make actually it only check. dip one. Yeah. Yeah. I'd still like to search for the med pack and see if I could get an upgrade. Yeah, you should because you need as many dice as you can right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. So I give you a blue. Yeah. Okay, so you you do have one. Yeah. Okay, so I'll do that, and then I'm gonna use a light the, our final light side point here and take an upgrade too to the check. Cool. All right. Uh, you, um. Yep. I have diff one in there, and if you've got all your boosts and stuff in there, I do. Then, then go for it. Yep. Okay. Nice. So that's enough to wake me up. Yep, you've got one Tim. That's enough to commit. So, so question. Yep. So my current cap was twelve, and yeah. I was already at the cap when you 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 messaged me in private to take another one. I'm assuming right. I can't go over cap, right? Uh, no. When you go over cap, you take a wound. Okay, so I would take an extra wound. It's still only two, uh, but that puts me down to ten strain, 
and then heals both of my wounds. Yeah. All right. So nice. I'm on wait um, upon waking up and like as soon as I realize what's going on, I'm gonna try and I'm gonna commit that force die again. So yeah, go ahead. It's spread. Okay. All right, so uh, what I'm like, the did Kravik we just happened? <laughs> so uh, I'm like, did, did did we get him? I'm gonna look around and I'm like, yeah, you got him. <laughs> I'm gonna see that they're cut in half, so I'm gonna know it came from uh, from Jay from so, Garo. <laughs> so he's uh, Garo's gonna kind of like offer his hand to get you up on your feet and be like, you're doing all right, buddy. I'm gonna take your hand and I'm gonna and when I when you when you help me up, I'm actually gonna give you like one of those like bro hugs. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna pull you in. and I'm like. You did good. Two tabs kid. on the back, no more. Yeah, yeah. right. I'm, I'm gonna smell your hair like Joe Biden <laughs> style. <laughs> no. Excellent. Yeah. yeah. No. Uh, I was so gonna yeah. like. Huh? <laughs> it's a cultural <laughs> thing for his people. They don't have hair. We don't have hair, so we're just like, this is amazing. What is this stuff growing out of you? Yeah. yeah. So, so you you definitely earned some respect with uh, Zoltan today. So. Uh, Garo's gonna be Garo's feeling great, so he's just. I mean, he's he doesn't even have that much strain anymore, so he's just gonna go. He's gonna be like, I'm gonna go look around, make sure there isn't any more of these idiot things roaming around. All right, yeah, Nisk is gonna like super carefully walk over all the all the corpses, making sure not to uh to step on anything, and then resume his quest that we started about an hour ago to the bridge <laughs> while. While I'm looking to make sure there isn't any more of these, Brendan, um, is mm -hmm. there any way to like do a rolling perception or something so that I could look for those uh, secret compartments that I figured out were going to be on here? Yeah. And that NIST, uh, NIST and confirmed you, would be on I'll here? give you a boost on my side so you don't need to put it on there. <clears throat> okay. So I will roll perception. Ready? Mm-hmm. Nice. Oh, yeah. So as you're going, you do find a um, <coughs> you find a, a, a small panel and you open it up. Jay, can you go ahead and pause the video real quick? Oop. I didn't. Uh... <laughs> yep, paused. I, I mean, it's just going to roll. I just got to cut this later. So just <laughs> well, we're probably pretty close to like a good stopping point, right? Yeah. No, but I want to uh, pop a, ho uh, a, a holocron image on the screen before we uh, oh. we get there. And so I think it would be awesome if I had a handout to do that with. Um, you could end it once I find that, I guess. Yeah, that's yeah. what I'm thinking, is that's a really awesome way to end the episode. Mm -hmm. Oh, um, it says he had a, a strain in there or a dis or whatever you want to call it. Uh, maybe he trips over it, right? <laughs> Uh, no, he'll like pinch his fingers or something. It'll be all right. Uh, handout file. Okay. Uh, ready when you are. In we'll come back and... Okay. Yep. You got it. Three, two, one. So. With that strain, you uh, get yourself, uh, like, you jam your finger in there, it, like, pinches and hurts like hell. Um, okay. So you just take a strain. And then um, tucked in a small box, you find er, you, you find a small wrapped uh, burlap. And when you unwrap the burlap, a small light emits. And you see oh, no. this box inside it. Oh, man. Oh, oh no. That's that's not whiskey. Strange. And gods. when when you see that, it's a great time for us to go ahead and remind you guys to like, share, subscribe, all that, and we will see you guys next time. No! I was expecting the plug for the holographic puzzle box now available on the fifth through <laughs> They're coming. Let's do what we can do. Don't you worry. <laughs> So thank you, everybody. Everybody say goodbye, and we will see you next time. Goodbye, everybody. See ya. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye.